I never thought we'd end up back here again. It seems like forever ago that you were injured. Have you figured out your mission? What you must do? I... I just want to help you out. I see. But that's not all. I want to protect the spirits as well. You go to such lengths to protect humans. So it's only fair that I become strong enough to protect spirits too. Hmm. You will strive to be our protector. A bold statement. Maybe I've been wrong about humans after all. Hmm? I never imagined one of you wanting to protect our kind, let alone making it his mission. I'm almost speechless. I've never felt this happy. Now I really must destroy the Lance of Kresnik. For all our sakes. That reminds me. What are you planning on doing after you've destroyed the Lance? Destroying the Lance and the Spyrex devices is merely one facet of my mission here. My whole reason for existing hasn't changed. So you'll return to Nia Kara and live the way you did before? Most likely. But with Exodus around, won't your life still be in danger? Hmm. Also likely. What you need is a bodyguard, someone to watch your back. Are you offering to stay with me? Uh... Is that possible? If that's what you decide to do, then you should do it. I'll need to create some story to keep you by my side. Really? Thank you. It's the least I can do. You're the reason I'm standing here right now, preparing to fulfill my mission. I'm the one who should be thanking you. Huh? Oh, no, you don't have to do that. We haven't even gotten to the real fight yet. Good point. Oh, just the pair I was looking for. Your wyverns have fully recovered. Somehow, the horse trainer was able to fully heal our wyverns. Thank goodness. Let's return to the plaza. Okay. All right. Time to get moving and once again. Also, I need to. Uh, I need to stop by the food vendor. And make sure I have dishes, because Ardith has told me of points ahead that I need dishes for it. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Where's Alvin? He hasn't shown up yet. He's probably figuring out his next lie. That's not true. What does everyone else think of Alvin? Would you feel safe going into battle with him? I just want to say right now, if these characters say that we can't have Alvin come with us, I'm not going to be pleased, because I love Alvin. He's just trying to help out his mom, right? I'm a sucker for that kind of stuff. I worry he himself will be unable to deal with that way of life much longer. <laughs> Don't forget, Alvin was the one who saved me from the bad guys! What do you think? We'll need to keep up our guard around him until he reveals his hand. He remains trustworthy in battle, at least. No, no, it's not polite to talk about someone behind his back. I don't care. What can I say? You guys are my only allies. It's a good thing that Alvin doesn't care if anyone else cares. You can tell by his nonchalant, 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 nonchalant figure. Jude's that face. Everyone. Let's be off. Oh, uh, Jude's face, just then. That was great. Please wait. Rowan, are you really going to fight with your old buddy? It is my fault that Noctagall became the man he is. 
I am prepared to fight him when the time comes. You have our support. Don't worry, I'll be right behind you. I've got your back, too. Thank you, everyone. Don't worry, I'll pick up your dentures if you drop them, Grandpa. <laughs> Please do. What, no pithy retort? I guess that means we're all ready. Let's make our final preparations before setting off. Stupid phone going off in the middle of a cutscene. Thankfully, I had it on a... Elise, what happened? You're tottering all over the place. I was staring at the windmill, and now the world keeps spinning. Ah, there's no beating big cities. So many interesting things for a grown man to see and do. We all know what Alvin's talking about right now. We know. Flying was so much fun! The wyverns weren't as scary as I thought they'd be. I'm just glad they didn't eat you. Huh. Too bad they didn't eat Alvin the traitor. Oh, did I forget to mention wyverns only eat children? But they don't eat their flesh. They nibble away at their souls. So gently that the kids don't even notice. While you were enjoying soaring through the sky, most of your soul could have been chewed away. That's a lie. That's total nonsense. Oh, I was right to be afraid. <laughs> they make it too easy. Oh, Alvin. Torturing small children. Typical him. Where is the, uh, are you the food vendor? Oh, yeah, you are. Okay. All right, sweet. So, Artith tipped me off that we're going to want some dishes that last a couple of battles. Uh, what are my options like way on down? Here we go. Increases EXP and gold by 50%. That's only two battles, though. I haven't unlocked the next... Wait a minute. Can I, like, unlock the next level of stuff, maybe? Needs the dove. Got a wild bird egg. That did nothing. All my mysterious beads. All three of them. Croquet bun and peach pie large. I don't think that's what I wanted, but whatever. It's probably always good to level up the thing that I'm about to buy from, because that probably discounts a lot of the stuff I'm probably about to buy. I think he said it needed to be at least three battles. This is EXP and gold by 30%, and it's for eight battles. Let me get, like... These are expensive, though. Can I only get one? Why can't I get two? I guess you can only have one of a certain dish at a time. It seems. And I also have the same one that does five battles. Okay. I should be good then. Let's go. Time to fly. Have you finished everything you need to do? I believe so. Let's depart. Is it going to be animated again? Thank you for everything. Please return home safely, for my brother as well. You have my word, young madam. <coughs> Ooh, someone was in my throat. I had to stop the cutscene for a second. <laughs> then let's be off. Animation? Doesn't look like it. Oh, well. Can't have everything. I believe we just need to follow this road to reach Fenmont. Yeah, let's go. All right, off to Fenmont we go. These awesome wyverns. Can I talk with it? Oh, sweet. I can just go to Sherilton whenever I feel like it on it. Give me this. And the walking begins. I'm sure you can see why it wouldn't be practical to ride the wyverns at Fenmont. You'd get spotted right away! Yes, there'd be no avoiding a battle, and civilians would get dragged into it. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. But is it really okay to leave the wyverns alone like that? They shouldn't have anything to fear from the monsters. Because the monsters are their friends? Oh, no, no. The wyverns may look docile, but they can be quite tough when they need to be. Monsters aren't their friends. Monsters are their food. Really? Oh, I was right to be afraid! 
<laughs> Wyverns don't play any games. They will om nom nom on any monster well, that tries and take them. Like this. I can't help but imagine someone blocking off the other end. That would suck. Why would you say that? Now now if that happens, I have to blame you, Rowan. Where are we? Barnawa High Road. Oh, we're on the opposite side of Fort Gondala. Okay. Okay, I see where we are. Ah, oh, crap. Leave me alone. We're gonna try and sneak up on the shield guy and take him down. Alright. Stop walking away, please. And stop turning. There you go. Just stay there. Almost got gotcha. you. Yeah, back attack. Alright, time to put these guys in their place. They're weak to light. All of them are weak to light. I don't... I have the... Oh, wait, I have a Sunspark or whatever it is. Don't I? Wait a minute. Let me make sure. I'm pretty sure it's down, right? Yeah, Sunspark. That's light. Does it link into a light attack? Light and darkness are combined to open a gate that sucks in foes and explodes them out. Uh, it doesn't say it does light or dark, but whatever. Sunspark! Go, Judgment Gate! That is pretty awesome, not gonna lie. Look at this, look at this go. I like that attack, that's pretty cool. Now let's get rid of this guy. Jude and Mila get like the best uh, chain link attacks from what I've seen. Igneous Crush, uh... Please forgive us for defeating you. And taking your items, that's just spoils of war. That's just the spoils of war. <laughs> I think Jude's about to level up, so I'll do Lillian Morb in a minute. But, uh, yeah, they get, like, a, that attack that I just did, whatever it was called, the one with Sunspark, the, um, the Lightning Strike one, they get, no, let's just fight you. They get, uh, Igneous Crush, Final Gale is pretty cool. Probably have other ones I haven't used yet. Go, Judgment Gate! Get him. Ow, I got hit from behind. That's not cool, man. Go, Judgment Gate! Die! No, no lemon gels. No lemon gels for you. Judgment Gate! Judgment Gate is awesome. Love it. You need to die right now. Ow. I also still love Lightning Strike. Nice. Time for you to go. Why do I have Rowan instead of Elise? Like, Elise always needs to be in battle. It's just like a fact of life. Victory! Yeah, not gonna let anyone down. Always need to have Elise in battle. Like, Leia and... Mila switch and Alvin and Rowan switch if needed. Or if I need to do something different than that, I do it differently. And all of them are about to level up too. So I really don't want to do Lilium Orb. I don't want to do Lilium Orb and then have to do it again in five minutes. Let's sneak up on this Scorpion. Never mind, he's got the angry face. not Or not the angry face, but the little angry thing above his head. Oh, look at these glowing trees. Got four bees nest, not bad. Don't know why there are four bees nests just chilling out in the random bag, but whatever. It's the dodo birds! They're back! And they're weak to dark instead of light. Uh, let's get rid of this insurgent guy first. Die! Die, you die! I'm so close to my overlimit. Sunspark! Time to spam lightning strike. Go! Judgment Gate! Oh, it didn't suck him in. I thought it would suck him in. Oh, well. He's dead now, anyway. Are you okay? Yep. I'm all okay. Just... I can't stop. All right, one more fight, then I'm doing Lilium Orb no matter what. Be gone! Be gone! 